Hello, and welcome to the Dataman 80 Quick Start video. This video will show what to expect when unboxing a Dataman 80, including how to set up the hardware and connect to the reader using the Dataman setup tool. To unbox a brand new Dataman 80, remove the cardboard insert from the box, and then peel the plastic away from the cardboard on the back of the insert to release the reader from the packaging. Do not use any sharp objects to avoid potentially damaging the product. Right out of the box, the Dataman 80 is fully assembled with lighting and a lens. To set up your new Dataman 80, you will need mounting hardware for your desired application, a computer with access to the Dataman setup tool, the correct cable for your model, and your model's respective power supply. The Dataman 80 has two different models that utilize different power supplies. This video utilizes a USB model, which will get its power directly from the computer, whereas the Ethernet models require a PoE injector. The first step to set up the Dataman 80 is to mount it to a stand. Start by connecting the reader to the selected mounting bracket. On the bottom of the Dataman 80, there are two threaded holes. Line these up with the corresponding holes on the mounting bracket. Place one of the included bolts through a set of aligned holes into the bottom of the reader. Repeat this with the second set making sure the bracket stays aligned and then tighten both screws with an Allen wrench to secure the reader. Next, mount the bracket to the stand. This step will differ depending on the style of stand you are using. For this demo, the angled mounting bracket is being secured to the stand using a nut, bolt, and washer. Once again, use a tool, in this case an Allen wrench, to make sure the hardware is secure. Adjust the bracket as needed so that the reader is pointed down to where the codes will be presented. Position the reader at a slight angle to reduce reflections and improve the performance of the vision system. The next step in the setup process is to connect the reader. First, plug the USB-C head of the cable into its respective port on the back of the reader. Next, take the other end of the cable and plug it into the power supply. In this case, the USB cable head is plugged directly into the computer. Once the power supply has been connected, the green LEDs on the top of the reader will start lighting up. Wait until the reader beeps to indicate that it has successfully powered on before trying to connect to the reader. The setup process can now be completed in the Dataman setup tool. If you have not already downloaded the software, refer to the Dataman setup tool install video for instructions. In the Dataman setup tool, all the readers on your network will be listed with information about their network settings and firmware. Connect to your reader by double-clicking it in the list. Next, click the Optimize Image step to set up the image. Click Live to enter the live mode and confirm a sample code is in the reader's field of view. When this step is complete, click Live again to exit live mode. Next, click Tune to optimize focus and lighting settings for the reader based on the code presented. To capture a reading of the sample code, the reader can be triggered by clicking the trigger button in the top left of the software. Results will be listed in the results history pane located in the lower right corner. If a code is not read, try checking the reader's train settings. The Dataman setup tool's default settings may train the reader to only read codes with the same size, orientation, and symbology type as the one presented when the reader was tuned. To untrain the previous code, click Untrain Code and uncheck the Train After Tuning checkbox to prevent this from happening again. The Symbology settings can be changed in the Code Details application step. Uncheck the Disable Untrained Symbology checkbox and confirm your desired code symbology type is selected. This concludes the Quick Start setup process. For more information, check out the other videos in the Dataman 80 setup and troubleshooting series. Thank you for watching. Thank <laughs> you.